Hi, my name's Teresa and I'm a dancer and runner. I'm unable to run with my club at the moment due to the current situation with social distancing. But my club have come up with a really good idea to keep us motivated. So, taking on one of my runs. And the reason I run isn't just for physical health, it's for mental health. Teresa and Geraldine normally run together with the dance and runners, but now due to coronavirus, they're running together virtually. During this very surreal time with coronavirus, you know, you just put on your orange top and you feel part of a community, even though you can't physically be together. You can share your runs in the running group and they support you and celebrate with you or pick you back up if it's not been the greatest run. They are indeed my running family. Dance and runners are also using their one exercise a day to raise money for their local community hospice. Usually we have about 400 patients on our caseload in the community. At the moment we've got about 700. So as, as well as the uh, operational and logistical challenges that we face and the extra demand that we're seeing, we also are finding that our charitable income is massively affected by this crisis. So it was amazing um, to hear that Dance and Runners were going to be supporting us in this. The runners are challenged online to run a distance of their choice and when they complete it, they make a donation to the hospice. There's an option of a 5k, 7k or a 10k. So basically you can uh, go out any time, just, just do your run um, and all, all proceeds go to uh, Greenwich and Bexley Community Hospice. This is inspiring lots more people to get out take part and donate. So what brilliant way to be able to raise money and get fit at the same time. Jen O'Reilly, BBC London.